Okay, we're at the uh, at the circus inside of Circus Circus, and you guys get to listen to me talk over the video because I'm just trying to upload this video to YouTube, and they're trying to strike me for copyright, even though this is out in the commons, <clears throat> and I'm not real sure what the copyright strike is for, except maybe it's the music <clears throat> that the organist or the pianist, or however you say it, and the drummer are playing. But anyway, really enjoyed watching this this young lady perform um, it's her name is Pei Pei and she's a foot juggler that's how they advertise it and so you can see her twirling these cloth whatever they are I don't even know what they're called and she makes an error there but that's the only one throughout the entire routine where she drops her little cloth napkin things and we did get to speak to her after the performance and she says she practices quite a bit. If you don't understand how much practice and effort these people put into being able to do this, then, <clears throat> then you've not ever tried to do anything as simple as a handstand or spinning a basketball on your finger. It's extremely difficult. It takes lots of practice and they basically have to specialize in doing one thing whereas most people don't ever even ever make the effort to specialize in anything now I thought this was pretty cool because when I was a kid I used to be able to do this basic uh, maneuver with barrels we had barrels and I could walk on the barrels and I could juggle them now I never tried anything like this this is amazing though if you think about how she can spin this drum it looks like a drum to me it reminds me of a big piece of cheese but look it's a drum of some sort and the kids really enjoyed watching watching this lady perform she did about a six minute routine so you're gonna have to listen to me talk for six minutes but look at that isn't that amazing how she was able to just you know, the rhythm, the timing, the confidence, and then with all these people watching, it had to be, it has to be difficult. Let's wait till you see what she does with this table. And I have another one. I have two more videos because we didn't watch a lot. The, the problem with going and watching these routines at Circus Circus is they start every hour on the half hour, so they begin like at 1.30 in the afternoon and then they go until 8.30 or 9.30 is like when they, look at that, look at how fast she's spinning that table, isn't that amazing? You think you could do that with your dining room table? That's what, you know, that's what you should do, you should go in and get your dining room table, look at the kids, the kids were just absolutely amazed by it. Yeah, you, you, that's the challenge. Go get your dining room table and try to spin the table in the living room. But anyway, the circus circus routines, they start on the half hour and they have an opening act, which is usually, which when everyone we saw was a clown performing either magic or juggling or whatever. <clears throat> and those are cool, but um, then they do the main act like this young lady doing her foot juggling but after she's done so you're looking at maybe 15 minutes total time at the most then there's not another performance until the next half hour so you have to basically wait for 45 plus minutes to see the next show well who wants to sit in the bleachers for 45 minutes because they're not comfortable you want to see a continuous show you don't want to see a 10 minute show and then have to go somewhere for 50 minutes and then come back and try to find another seat it's a pain in the butt to be honest with you so to sit and watch all the shows that circus circus offers is probably not realistic unless you just make a day of it and even then they don't have the same shows day after day the juggling or excuse me the trapeze show that we wanted to watch we actually had to wait 
two or three days before it was even done. And we went the day before because I got the schedule mixed up. And we went when we thought it was going to be showing and we ended up having to leave and come back another day, the next day because I made the mistake of misreading the schedule and getting my days confused. Anyway, watch what she does with this little ball. It's pretty cool. She's gonna, and just, I mean, just something like this, the balance, accuracy, and to not make a mistake. Anyway, we've got more videos to share. Look at that, amazing. Makes me wanna clap here. If I wasn't holding this record button down, I probably would. So we've got the contortionist, we've got the trapeze, we've got this young lady doing her foot juggling. We would have watched more acts, but it's just not easy to do. So um, subscribe to our channel, leave some comments, let me know what you think. I'm sorry I had to talk over the video, but that's just YouTube's, YouTube's fault.